Hello everyone, I just encountered a huge problem and I will show you what it is real quick. Um, as you notice you're on this site, but let me show you. If I go to here, it's going to redirect me, right? And uh, I just ran this, uh, I just got rid of this problem. Alright, so right now I'm getting redirected. Anytime I go here, it's going to redirect me to this. And we're going to go ahead and nip this in the butt right now. I know you're reading the blog, but this is how we're going to take care of it. I'm going to go ahead and select my database. And you can tell which database that you're using by looking at your WP config file. But I'm going to select the database. I'm going to go to SQL. Set options. So this is the old URL, new URL. Old URL, new URL, old URL, new URL. And if you're using a security certificate, you're going to have to put the S in here. All right. So what I do is I select the database, I go ahead and simulate the query. It's going to say zero match rows because I've already ran this, but if uh, this runs correctly, it's going to say it matched a row every time it finds uh, your old domain in the database. And what you're telling it is to replace it with this domain. So you just click go, it runs, it replaces everything, and then you're able to log into the back end. Now, I use a plugin called Updraft Plus Advanced Tools. So, I don't use the whole domain. These are both .coms. So, we're just going to search for any time we see this. We're going to replace it with this, and we're going to go ahead and run it. So it replaced it 2,344 times, and we should be able to So that did work. All right, that's it, folks. That is how to search and replace a database using PHP my admin without doing a SQL dump or using any type of WordPress plugin in order to access your backend. Thanks very much, and like this video and subscribe for more tips and tricks.